District Attorney Andrew Wiley and Assistant District Attorney Jeffrey Stitt interviewing New York State Police Investigator Thomas Brown for nearly an hour and a half, playing a video of Singundo Clark being interviewed by Brown, asking him where he was the past few days and who Ginger Clark was. He told Brown he'd been in the Schenectady area hanging out with his friend Janelle, but didn't know her last name and repeatedly denying knowing someone named Ginger Clark. When asked how he got Ginger's car, Singunda Clark was seen in the video saying it was his car. When the investigators provided Singunda Clark with the car registration that was in Ginger's name, he said, quote, well, that's weird. It wasn't until over an hour into the taped interview that he finally admits he knew Ginger, but doesn't say it was his grandmother. Earlier Monday morning, investigator Brandon Frost from the New York State Police showed physical evidence from the Rudy Road crime scene, including swabs from different rooms, a hoodie with blood stains on the sleeve, as well as a steak knife with a broken handle and a red substance barely noticeable. Investigator Frost also says they found the rug Ginger was wrapped in. <laughs>